always tracking, always alerting. This is Storm Team 8. Well, look at this. This is a live picture from Mackinac Island. And while we had the warm air, temperatures up close to 60 here at daybreak, it was cold enough for snow up here. And I'm going to scoot out of the way and show you. Look at all the snowmobiles here parked in front of Horn's Bar and Restaurant. Uh, cold temperatures, lots of snow across the UP. We're going to be doing some skiing this week while we're in the sunshine and warmer air here. Well, uh, take a look at the flags out at Allendale. You can see there's still a pretty healthy br breeze out there, but it's not as windy as it was. And these winds will continue to calm down a bit here overnight tonight. These are some of the wind gusts that we had. Look at that saga tuck on the beach, 72 miles an hour. Once we get to 74, 75, that's hurricane force. Grand Haven at 68, that was at the, uh, at the uh, lighthouse there. Cedar Springs at 62, Cascade at 59, and East Grand Rapids at 54. We'll try and share a few more uh, wind reports with you a little bit later on. This is our future cast. We run it to tomorrow morning at 7 a.m., and it's clear across the area, so we're going to see a nice sunrise come tomorrow morning. As, uh, by the way, oh, this is uh, Storm Track Live, excuse me, this is Storm Track Live, and you can see there's still snow going on off to the north. Uh, we've got a few flurries that are just kind of tapering off into southeastern Michigan. Snow off to the north, still uh, some slippery roads once you get uh, from around the Gaylord area off to the north. Winds diminish, still breezy tomorrow, uh, mostly sunny skies for tomorrow and Monday, two days in a row. And we could come close to 60 degrees here during the day on Wednesday. Now on to the future cast. We run the clock here to 7 a.m. And as you can see, we are clear across the area. A nice sunrise, winds turn to the southwest tomorrow, so it brings up more mild air. One o'clock in the afternoon, we're still clear, seeing some sunshine and a few high clouds start to come in here. These look kind of thicker here on the graphic than what we're going to see, but uh, watch for a few high clouds to come in during the afternoon. And I think we'll have anywhere from a partly to mostly sunny day during the day on Tuesday. Here's low temperatures tonight, a little bit below freezing, and so that means if there's any puddles out there, those are going to be icing up a bit, so watch out for that. Could be a slippery spot there. Some of the uh, high temperatures, uh, We'll see readings up into the low to mid 40s during the day tomorrow. Uh, temperatures should be in the mid 40s tomorrow afternoon across the Grand Rapids area. It could even be some upper 40s, uh, especially along the lakeshore uh, in the southern counties here. But it uh, should be a pretty nice day. Wind's a little bit lighter than today. You can see the wind's tapering off 9 miles an hour tonight and then back up to around 15 miles an hour here come tomorrow afternoon. So let's look for our, uh, at our forecast for you. I think we'll be seeing our temperatures in the mid 40s tomorrow, upper 40s on Tuesday. Wednesday could be the warmest day of the week. It won't be a great day because we're going to see a lot of clouds and the possibility for some uh, drizzle to develop across the area, a few light showers. Uh, we'll be seeing uh, that uh, warm air kind of push away, and we'll be back closer to average here by the time we hit next weekend. 60 so, in December. 60. It's, it's in Michigan. Before. I remember in 1982, we hit 65 times oh, wow. uh, during the month, and it was 65 on Christmas Day, and I picked a dandelion on Christmas Day. Well, I hope we have that for Christmas this year, mm. but I'm not going to have my hopes up. No, I don't think, it'll, I don't think in fact, uh, toward Christmas, it may get colder. I'll tell you more about that later, too. All right. Thanks, Bill.